All right. Today is going to be the start of a new series called Montgomery Ward Revisited. So here we are at Herberger's former Montgomery, formerly Montgomery Ward at 901 Apache Mall. It opened in 1969, has two levels, majorly renovated in 1990, and then Herberger's took it over in 2001 after Ward's bankruptcy. You can kind of see up on that top tier the Ward's label car, and also the store. There's a great resemblance to the Dixie Square Mall store in Harvey, Illinois. Built around the similar era. Let's go in. And the door's broken, so we're gonna have to go in this store. Freight elevators back then. There's the elevator. I think Electric Avenue was on this level. There's the escalators. The store's not very big, it's only 70,000 square feet. We're gonna take a quick look around the main floor. There's the mall. Quick preview of Apache Mall, I may do a video out there eventually. Let's head this direction around the store. Escalators. Let's go this way. So I think Electric Avenue may have been on the main floor. And then another thing that bears great resemblance to Dixie Square Mall is over here. This door vestibule. These are some of the original doors out of the store. Vintage Conier. A quick look around this vestibule. Original doors. And then we will go back in. Loop around this part of the store. I think there would have been access out to the auto center around this point, because the auto center stood right out that direction. <coughs> There's the escalators over there. You can see them. We're going to head upstairs. I think there's some original displays from Wards actually upstairs. You can see the updated departments over here. So this kind of proves my theory about Wards operating on smaller... Um, format locations. So I've never actually filmed these before. It's Montgomery Twinkie Yum. we go. This corner I pretty much think has been upgraded. I don't know if there's anything to see back here, but we'll walk back here anyway. There's some lighting that could be from Lawrence. Let's get a quick look back there. Yeah, guys, see, there's the Dover Freight Elevator. Back there. Let's go this way. I think that down sign might be from Wards right there. I don't know. If y'all know, tell me. Here we go, anyway. 
Maybe around the children's department. Now, I think a lot of this colorful trim you're going to see up here. I did. So there is, that may be part of the old kids department. I don't know, that carpet looks pretty old. So I believe Herberger's opened in 02. And this, I definitely have seen built-ins similar to this in former Ward stores. I think these built-ins may be from Ward's. So this is just the, this is just a corner here. Not ready. All right. Now we're heading down the main aisle of the store. On the second level. I'm not going in that maze, don't even ask. I'm actually going to head over and look at the uh, up area on the escalators. Anyway. An overlook at the escalators, and then I'm headed down. Go through here. The store does have a Dover Freight elevator. I'd like to get on it at some point. We're gonna go to the bottom. We're actually gonna go back to the elevator corner and we're gonna get one right on the elevator into this video as well. Alright. Now, the store has none of the infamous peachy color, like infamous in Ward's locations in the 90s. It does not have any of that. But. So here we are. You may recognize this monstrosity. This is the 1990 Montgomery Twinkie M Vector Elevator. It's kind of a little beat up since, but we're going to take one ride. It's a cab view. It used to have a phone box, but it no longer does. And if you didn't know, the service box, you just pull right here, and that's the service box on the Vector. This elevator has extremely hard leveling, as I previously mentioned. There's the exterior second floor of the store. So, uh, Guys, let me know if you like this series. Next door will be Midway Marketplace, St. Paul, Minnesota. Built in 1996, I believe, as awards. So, anyway, guys, that's going to be about it. So, this new series is called Montgomery Ward Revisited, if you didn't catch it. Um, so, yeah, so, you guys, please like, comment, and subscribe, and that will be all.